This is Sandeep, the owner of Pure Indian Foods in New Jersey. But of course right now he's not in New Jersey. Right now, Sandeep is in one of the world's most unique environments hunting for one of the world's rarest superfoods. It's a nut called Sacha Inchi. And to explain why it's so special, we're going to take some time in this video to talk about where it comes from. Sacha Inchi needs a very special climate, so that's why we had to travel from New Jersey all the way to South America to find it. Of course, you can't expect to just travel to Lima and find Sacha Inchi. It only grows in a very specific region of this country. So from Lima, we get in a car and now travel north to the foothills of the Andes Mountains in the San Martin region of Peru. This is not a rainforest. This is a cloud forest. A rainforest is a tropical forest with an annual rainfall of 100 inches or more, with trees forming a canopy. On the other hand, a cloud forest is a type of rainforest, but the altitude is usually much higher, somewhere in the range of 3,000 to 8,000 feet. Rainforests are located at lower elevations, and as a result, they tend to be much warmer, especially during the dry season. Cloud forests, on the other hand, are usually located at these higher elevations and are much cooler. This difference in temperature contributes to the mist and fog that's often visible in cloud forests, and the milder temperatures slow the evaporation process. However, despite being a little cooler than rainforests, cloud forests are still very humid. Elevation isn't the only factor that separates cloud forests from rainforests. The lay of the land, also known as topography, plays a crucial role. Rainforests tend to cover large expanses of land with little change in elevation, whereas cloud forests often feature dramatic shifts in the high peaks and low valleys contributing to the amount of rainfall and atmospheric moisture. This unique biome is the home of Sacha Inchi in Peru. Let's look at a few maps of this area to get a better idea of where Sacha Inchi comes from. Feel free to pause the video at any time and take a closer look. In this first map, we can see the waterways of Peru. When we get a bigger picture of the area, we can see that all of the top 10 rivers of Peru all flow into the Amazon. This image shows the population density of Peru, with the vast majority of people living along the coast and you can see a large concentration in the capital city of Lima. Now here, we see the elevation. The Andes Mountains hug the coast, allowing massive amounts of water to flow into the Amazon basin. And this may be the most important image of all for what we're talking about. Here we see the different types of environments in Peru. It's incredibly diverse. On the coast, we see the desert and then the foothills leading into the mountains, and then that dark green strip in the center is the cloud forests, followed by the light green rainforests. It's that thin green strip that is the native home of Sacha Inchi. So now you know why Sandeep is here in the San Martin region of Peru. He's searching for organic Sacha Inchi in its native environment. Sacha Inchi really is worth all the effort to find. I know I've already called it a nut in this video, but technically it's a legume, although the indigenous people have called it the mountain peanut for years. 
It's been cultivated in this area for thousands of years, but it can still be found in the wild. The seeds are rich in omega-3, 6, and 9 fatty acids, and the oil is high in vitamin E and antioxidants. Traditionally, the indigenous people of Peru use Sacha Inchi for food, as well as for medical and cosmetic purposes. The oil flavor is slightly nutty and somewhat familiar to almond or sesame seed oil. It's sensitive to light and heat, which is why we store it in dark glass and recommend refrigeration. The oil also has a low smoke point, making it best for things like salads and other cold applications. It's great for things like salad dressings, spreads, dips, and sauces. You can even blend it with other oils or butter. Pure Indian Foods Sacha Inchi Oil is cold pressed to preserve the natural benefits, and no solvents are used in the extraction process. It's 100% pure, USDA certified organic and non-GMO. Of course, virgin and unrefined. Sacha Inchi deserves your attention. It's an ancient superfood that is only now being discovered by a modern audience. You can find out more about Sacha Inchi oil and all kinds of other 100% pure products at our website, pureindianfoods.com.